So, one minute with Eric. What is seller financing? This comes up all the time. It just came up a minute ago. So here's generally the way it works. Somebody comes to me and they say, hey, I'm selling whatever. I'm selling my business. I'm selling the assets. I'm selling real estate. Doesn't matter what it is. And the buyer is not gonna pay the full purchase price when you do the closing. So here's an example. I'm gonna sell all the assets in my business. We call that an asset sale rather than a stock purchase sale. Stock purchase, they would buy the actual company. But I'm gonna sell all the assets. It's gonna be for 500,000, but they're gonna pay me 300,000 up front and the other 200,000 over the next two years. And I'm gonna let them make payments. So essentially what I'm doing is I could have said no. I could have said go to a bank, get the full purchase price. I don't want anything to do with you. But instead, I'm gonna take the financing risk. I'm gonna take the credit risk that you're gonna actually make all the payments. So now our deal just got a whole lot more complicated. We're not just doing an asset purchase in this case. We're actually also doing a financing agreement. So here's a question. Am I gonna have a personal guarantee? Are we gonna do security? What's the collateral? So a lot of things to think about, that's seller financing. 